Hello everybody, welcome to the weather forecast. Happy Tuesday, I hope you guys are having a great day as we work through this latest work week and we got a weather forecast. My name is Dooley Godot, also known as Mr. G. I am your weather forecaster. Welcome to Elite Weather Forecasting and we're gonna have a forecast for you guys today. And I hope you're watching me on TikTok and YouTube. And if you're on any, any one of those platforms, you can follow me on TikTok, subscribe to YouTube channel, leave your likes, comments, and interact with the video. So let's get started today, guys, where we're going to be talking about more of this is thunderstorms as we have thunderstorms affecting a big portion of the Midwest. We're also looking at an active tornado watch in effect across parts of the Midwest as well. And we even have a tornado warning area across parts of Iowa. So we're going to be taking a look at all of the activity that's going on today. We're looking at thunderstorms here in Minnesota as well. I've heard of a couple of very loud uh, bumps and rumbles of thunder just a little while ago as we have heavy rain and thunderstorms affecting the Twin Cities right now and we're looking at thunderstorms from Minnesota to Wisconsin all the way down into Iowa and Missouri and even over Illinois as well we are looking at some big thunder boomers today here is our first map as we talk about that severe weather that we're going to be seeing over a big portion of the Midwest today we have a, a really big area of low pressure here across the Midwest a nice upper level low and that's going to be bringing severe that severe threat and that's going to will increase with individual storms in the afternoon and evening so we're going to be seeing a lot of that over illinois and down through missouri we're going to be seeing discrete supercells and that's going to make linear thunderstorms so squall lines will become uh common this afternoon and into the evening hours tonight as we have more organized thunderstorm clusters where we're going to be seeing those damaging winds and, and large hail as well and some isolated tornadoes. So as we take a look at what we're going to be seeing today, those thunderstorms out there are going to be moving into uh, parts of Indiana, eastern Illinois. We're going to be seeing it through Wisconsin, heading into Michigan as well. We're going to be seeing those thunderstorms, but we're going to be seeing isolated storms down here across the plains. So Missouri, Iowa, we're going to be seeing more discrete thunderstorms. We're going to be looking at those tornadoes in this activity is what we're going to be looking at. And this is going to be what we're going to see about 8 o'clock tonight. Those thunderstorms coming up across the plains. And here is your severe weather forecast for today. And we're going to be seeing severe thunderstorms through Kentucky and through parts of the Tennessee, uh, Ohio, and up into Indianapolis. This is where we're going to be looking at for your Wednesday as far as the severe weather threat. And we're going to be seeing those those two two systems that will lead to severe weather through the midweek period here. And we're going to be seeing those thunderstorms as well Thursday down through the Ohio Valley, down across the uh, Southern Plains and the Mid Mississippi River Valley again into East Texas. We're going to be seeing those thunderstorms as we have a cold front because the cold front will overrun the, the majority of the dry line. So the thunderstorms will shift from the focusing along the dry line to focusing along the cold front as it the cold front catches up to deeper moisture that's over the 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 Ohio Valley and through the Midwest as we have deeper moisture over in this region and as the cold front reaches that deeper moisture and interacts with that deeper moisture then we're going to see those thunderstorms firing over the Ozarks uh, Arkansas uh, through Missouri, Illinois, Indiana, Ohio, Kentucky, Tennessee, uh, Louisiana, Mississippi, and Alabama. Here is our current uh, 
uh, radar right now we have uh, thunderstorms we got look at the thunderstorms we even have them up into Minnesota we're seeing these thunderstorms coming up from the south so lots of rain with embedded thunderstorms in this activity because we have the warm front around this region right here so we have uh, thunderstorms with some severe thunderstorm warnings and we also have a tornado warning right here this is for a tornado warning across central Iowa just to the west of Des Moines so tornado watch is in effect for this uh, midday here across uh, parts of the central plains here uh, from Des Moines all the way to just uh, south of Kansas City where we have our tornado watch in effect right now and we have our severe thunderstorm uh, threat across the Mississippi Valley and into the Ohio Valley is where we're going to be seeing that greatest risk today for a severe thunderstorm. So that's going to be Iowa, Missouri, uh, Arkansas, Illinois, Indiana, uh, parts of Ohio and West Virginia and into Minnesota and Wisconsin. We have the threat for severe thunderstorms today. So we have the, like we're looking for uh, the possibility of tornadoes. We have uh, damaging wind and large hail to look forward to. All three modes of severe weather is going to be expected today across the Midwest. And then we're gonna see thunderstorms tomorrow again across uh, portions of the Ohio Valley. So it shifts to the east so Indiana, Ohio, and then down through Kentucky and Tennessee and, and through Mississippi and uh, um, uh, Alabama as well, the potential there exists for a pretty good shot at severe thunderstorms tomorrow. Okay, so we also have some wet weather over the east in the mid-Atlantic states. We're looking at rain over New York City where the Trump trial is taking place right now. And we're also looking at some rain up around Buffalo and across the Canadian border into parts of Ottawa and uh, um, uh, maybe around Toronto and Montreal across the, 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 the St. Lawrence River Valley there. And we're looking at rain down to New York City and towards the Philadelphia and the DC area. So here is the rainfall forecast from Wednesday through Sunday as we're going to see cooler weather move into the east and we're going to see some little bit damp weather as well. So much of the eastern coastal sections is going to see less than a half an inch of rain. So relatively light rainfall amounts, a little bit heavier back towards the western parts of the northeast parts of maybe around Buffalo, Pittsburgh, you're going to see maybe between half an inch to an inch of rain. So generally less than an inch of rain here along the East Coast and that's over the three or four day period. So here is the three day forecast for the big cities of the East which includes New York, Philly, Washington, Boston, and Pittsburgh and you're going to see temperatures uh, uh, start off warm here 77 down in Pittsburgh but we're going to see it fall to the mid 60s and we're going to see 50s return to the other cities in the northeast as we get towards Friday so that is your weather forecast for today my name is Mr. G thank you for watching me today leave your likes comments and subscribe to the videos on whichever platform you see them on and i will see y'all tomorrow with another weather forecast video that might sound a lot like today so it's that time of the year where it doesn't change very much so i will see y'all in the next video it's time for lunch i'm hungry and i gotta go Bye bye